Okay, hello and welcome to making the interior of the house. Um, I've already started. I've added um, a bedroom, a little eating area, and a little cupboard. And now we're going to be making this kind of uh, reception area. We just need to finish up a few little things in the bedroom, I think. And then we'll get straight on. I think I'll leave it at that. Okay, um just have the rooms. Remember to put everything on the right layer. If you um overlapping items or you'll be in a lot of trouble when you come to actually play your game. Yeah, I've not done the right layers there. There we go. Okay, and now we're into the reception room. And we just want to um, make it look as nice and as decorative as we can without making it look too cluttered and over the top. And really, it's just a case of putting things in the right place. Now the kind of thing that I've gone for is quite a, um, a posh house, quite a decent house, so we're having lots of big rugs and um, big kind of reception room. And I think um, that is how we'll leave it, like that. Now you will need to be um, creating events to be able to get in and out the house. So we'll show you how to do that right now. Okay, you want to be clicking on this little box here that is events. And double click on the spot where you want to create one. Um, you want it to play at touch. And all you need to do is go on to transfer player to the place where you want it to be, so there. And you can apply that. And you can copy and paste that to um, there. Now you also need to be able to get inside the house. So we'll create another event here. And for this one we will add a door. Again, we'll have player touch, transfer player to there, I think. Okay, apply. And so when we play the game, we go in the house, we can walk around, we can check for any kind of bug that we may have done. You can get in the back. And it's all looking pretty fine. 
and there you go stay tuned for the next video and remember to visit my website at uh, RPG Maker XP Tutorials dot webs dot com.